Fille à Wino. Fille à Wino. Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Sophia, and I am back with another video. So, since I've been gone for a while, I figured I would come back with an easy hair tutorial. And today I'm going to be showing you guys how to curl your hair with a flat iron. Two new announcements. First off, Spider-Man Homecoming in theaters July 7th. That was an actual announcement. Second announcement, I want to thank everyone who has ever put out a YouTube video for curling their hair with a flat iron because this is how I learned and I hope that I can help someone else learn. This is especially for those ladies who struggle with curling their hair with an actual curling iron like I used to. And basically just for anyone who wants to learn how to curl their hair with a flat iron. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the flat iron I'm using today is the Infinity Pro by Conair. And I think this is a really cool flat iron. It works with my hair and I have really thick hair. And it's got these cool little features where you can lock and unlock. And um, that lets you change the temperature and lock in the temperature that you want it at. So I think it's a really cool feature. So while we wait for my flat iron to heat up, I'm going to put my hair up. I section my hair off into three different sections. Not all at once, but as I go through. The first section is a section right here at the top of my ears. And I just put this into a messy little top knot. And now we've got this bottom section of hair. What you're going to do, you're going to split the section of hair in half and you're going to bring it forward. Now what you're going to do, is starting from the back of the hair to the front of the hair, is you're going to keep taking little sections and you're going to curl it like that. Once you have your first little section from the back of the hair, about this size, What you're gonna do is you're gonna turn the flat iron outwards and you're gonna go turning it outwards until you get to the very bottom of the hair. And here you have a nice little curl. Depending what your preference is, you can hold it for longer periods of time or shorter periods of time. So just a quick tip that I forgot to mention, follow the curl along with your finger and that'll kind of help the curl stay in place. So I've curled the whole left side of the bottom section, but I know that I personally struggle with curling the right side of my hair, so I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So it's basically the same process, I'm just going to grab a quick little section right here. So what makes it harder is that you're reaching across. But it's basically the same process, you just have to not be scared of the curling iron. So you're just going to, once again, curl it outwards until you get to the bottom. As you can see, there's a little straight piece right here, and that's why I think I struggle so much. Because you can't really see where you're going, so I think it's very important that you look in a mirror when you're doing this. But we're going to try this again. What I like to do when I mess up a section is I'll go again and I'll just keep going until I get it right. Oof, a little smoke there. And once again, just go with the curl. Ow, don't get your finger tangled. So as you can see, I have the entire bottom section of my hair curled. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take down this little top knot I've got here. The second section we're going to put up is right here by my eyebrows. We're just going to pull back. So once again, we're going to go here. And we're going to split halfway through the middle. And you're just going to like finger through and find the pieces of hair that you have curled already as opposed to the ones that haven't been curled. Okay, now we're going to continue curling the same way that we have been. Just find a section in the back of your head. And you find that the 
from the bottom section to the top section, the top section is always the easiest to curl. the top nut on the top section and just like before we're going to lightly comb through the top section okay once again your hair looks really short we're going to split through the middle we're going to find the curled sections of our hair once again I've pulled out sections that I'm not really satisfied with and once again we're going to go from back to front just grabbing sections of hair and curling them. Okay, so this is pretty much the finished product. I'm just going to give you a quick spin. And yeah, that's how you get some tight curls using a flat iron. Now if you want the curls to be looser, like I usually do, I just put my fingers through and I shake a little bit so that you get a little bit of a looser feeling. And on any normal day, I would put a bunch of hairspray in my hair like we all do, but it's dark outside as you can see, and I'm not going to bed with hairspray in my hair. So thank you guys so much for watching. As always, remember to stay positive, be safe, love you guys, and I will see all your beautiful faces next video. Love you. Bye. So what you're going to do, and we're done. <laughs> so the flat iron that I'm using today is the Infinity Pro, Infinity Pro, he's like, oh shit, you're sorry. You're filming the wrong side of my face. Okay, so now I've got all the bottom section of my hair braided. And you might notice that they're different looking kind of curls. You said braided. Did I say braided? You said braided. So now let's just watch me curl the rest of my hair like the awkward group of people who watch YouTube videos we are. Yeah. So that. <laughs> the girl I killed herself. Oh, the girl, one of the girls killed herself by sh uh, shoving a hot, like, an on, um, curling iron down her throat. Hey. Please don't stab me with that. <laughs> Another one stabbing someone with a knife and then Turn it off. Oh.